Hey, it's Jabbo. Welcome to Brigzar, where I spent an entire week organizing my basement only to come up with a few nicely organized shelves that probably to you aren't that organized. But, but it is better than it was. So, hey, <laughs> welcome to uh, the new location of my BrickLink store. Still haven't got the lighting in, hadn't had time uh, to get the parts in from Lowe's. Uh, but that's that's coming. I have made sure I've left myself access to where I can reach uh, the wall in order to do the drop ceiling there. Uh, but I've been taking advantage of the time that I do have, which is very little in between other responsibilities, uh, to move things. So these things, while I've not closed my store, these things are still in my store. They're just now uh, in a little different order. These shelves, you can't see the whole thing in the shot that we have, but... Uh, these shelves hold 60 of the shoebox size containers. So I've got, this is A shelf, this is B shelf, and off camera over here, we have C shelf. Uh, and I still got to add a few more containers. So I cleared out, I, I did what I do best on this channel. I took stuff, stuff out of these boxes and put them in other boxes so I could have free shoeboxes. So that stuff, uh, it's like I just put off the sorting <laughs> by, to later by just dumping three boxes into like another bigger box just so yeah I why am i holding the cutters oh it's because i got these boxes over here i got these three boxes this is all for the uh, bricklink store so amazon had a sale and i just i need to open these even though i'm not going to use them right at the moment i need to open them just to make sure they're not broken they had a limit of six on these but it's the acro mills everyone's favorite way well not everybody's favorite way to store their lego it's a, a preferred method of a lot of bricklink sellers personal collectors may have other methods they choose uh, like when I, you see all these containers behind me they're not order in order by type of part or by color they're ordered by whatever is in that drawer or that container i should say and now they got these stack-ons they're not stack on stack on is a brand these are acro mills but you can stack them. Stack on was a brand that went out of business. So yeah, they had these 40 drawer containers. So let's see, there's 12 and 28. I think, is that how it is? Is there eight? Two, four, six, eight. Eight, 16, 24, 32. Well, I guess these are 44 drawer containers. Is that what these are? 44 I can't add I'm not good at adding but so I ordered six of these and so these are going to be for future expansion of the BrickLink store but where they're going to go is not available to do that but just wanted to let you know that yeah I did get six more of these so that'll be for future growth those Amazon deal they were $31 each and I bought six of them and now I'm going to have a whole bunch more cardboard waste uh, in my basement. So maybe I should come off of the tripod and just kind of walk you around the, the, the chaos that is the basement. This is actually the only organized part of the basement right now. But the BrickLink store is still open despite all the chaos. I've managed to start the move without closing the BrickLink stores. So Charlie has been playing soccer with uh, Lego pieces. I don't know how that piece got there. Hopefully that wasn't from my store. No, it's a vintage piece. It's not from my store. <laughs> so, so yeah. Anyway, this, this are the the the, the shoebox containers. I want to add. I got another shelf over here. Three more shelves of shoebox containers or the brown ones. I'm thinking I'd like actually would like to get rid of the brown ones. I'll show you show you those uh, in a minute. But um, so doing the big big things first, and then I'm going to be bringing those stack ons slash. Acromills containers to put on a wall that's over here and uh, and try to do that as best I can without even closing the store. We'll see if I'm able to do that. So I left room to put the door. I'm going to put the door in there. Hey, there's my lawnmower. There's the lawnmower that doesn't work. And then here's the C shelf. And then this is going to be D. I'm not sure if it's going to be brown boxes or not i still need to move these so look I, I i moved all the comic books over here and then i moved them again where did they go 
Oh, and that's going to be the wall where the stack ones are going to go. Uh, these are things I had to take off of the shelves temporarily, but I'll, I need to move all this stuff so I can slide this rug over and get the stack ons ready and acro mules to go there. So I had to steal those shelves. <laughs> uh, there was a shelf there. I took it. I'm going to need two more of those. I may put a different type of shelf or use that area for something different. Maybe it could be a mosaic wall. If I get those shelves out of the middle, maybe it could be a place to put a smaller train table than this. Of course, that's where the train table used to be. I don't really want to get cramped in there. Maybe I could make something. I don't know. Um, here's the uh, review table. Very nice and organized. Uh, oh, haul time. So I picked up this, the uh, orchid at Target. Just went ahead and used my 5% off. Um, I got some packages. I'll do those later. Not in this video. Wait till I get some more things in. This is where the comic books move. So this used to be the, uh, some shelves for the BrickLink store. I was able to consolidate all that into those shelves we started the video with. So this is the temporary location. This is, I decided to use this area for stuff that's got to go. <laughs> so all, all, all comics must go. I do have bids on some of the comic books, uh, which is good. That box is destroyed there. And so these are the brown boxes I'm talking about. I'm thinking maybe I don't want to use these anymore because I do like being able to look and see what's in the, the boxes and you can't with these. But then again, this probably protects them from light because this is the kind of thing that happens when things are exposed to light. doesn't matter if they're LED or not. We well, can't even hardly tell. This faded. This box for this train set, this sealed train set, it's, it's faded from the lights. Uh, I don't know. Uh, but let me go, okay, go back over here. So I got all these I need to move. Uh, these are the unsorted things. So th this used to be my BrickLink store, Z. Th these were boxes, I had them labeled Z. Those are all moved, and now these are all the multicolored variety of different containers. This was what happens when you buy stuff on clearance. You get a bunch of different types of containers. But this is all stuff that needs to be sorted. And then the BrickLink store, whoa, almost knocked it over again. Got to do something about that. This is what's all going to be moved. And the table is going to be moved. I'm going to figure out a better solution for the drawers. I mean, I got things in these drawers that does, er, that are not related to the BrickLink store. So I probably just need to make sure that this, whatever I use for the table and the drawers that are under it is only for the BrickLink store. Just not random stuff that has nothing to do with BrickLink. <laughs> Optimus Prime. Is out of commission so they might be bricks surprisingly has not finished this um i don't even know where the other there's the other pieces uh, the, the main thing is done uh one of the legs has messed up since he built it it kind of falls off real easy i don't know if that's a flaw of the i'm bleeding um but um, this typical bricks rb video I, I injure myself all the time doing these videos but yeah he he has not finished Optimus Prime. I found a John Ostrander, Ostrander um, signed Suicide Squad book. I think I showed that before. But yeah, he he needs to finish this. I don't want to have to finish it for him. Why has he not finished this? He's because something. He's not going to be here for a few months, so I'm. It's going to be tough <laughs> for me. Um, I don't. I didn't tell him I was saying this right now, but that's. Yeah, but he's got, he's got an assignment that he's going to be going on out of the state. So I'm hoping he finishes this before he goes. But if he doesn't, I'd rather him spend time with me uh, before he goes. Uh, but why, why did he not finish it? He, he was so looking forward to this Optimus Prime, and he didn't finish it. But because he's spending time with his friends. That's more important, friends. Isn't that right, Jean-Luc Picard? Locutus of Borg. <sighs> So I wasn't even going to film this video, but I just wanted to do something, kind of give you an update, because I actually took a week off from work, and I made like four videos the entire time. So just working down here, spending time with family, doing things that are more important than YouTube videos, but I haven't given up on YouTube. Just want to let you know that, too. There'll be more content coming, and I'm, going, I'm looking forward to when this gets all organized, and I hope uh, that will help me to uh, have a more efficiently run BrickLink store and be more um, space available for future growth of the basement and get rid of a lot of crap that I'm never going to use 
So um, anyway, that's the video for today. Uh, no script, no plan, uh, and just one injury. I'll see you guys 